Building the infrastructure of the future. I'm here with Amanda Saunders of NVIDIA to talk a bit more about it. Now AI, usually reserved for sci-fi movies, yeah. right? But now we're seeing it fundamentally intertwined with daily life, it's everywhere. Yeah. So can you talk to us a little bit about that and just how omnipresent it is right now? Absolutely. I mean, I think with ChatGPT and everything that's going on in the news today, you can see, especially things like generative AI, they're hitting their iPhone moment. Mm. Everyone has it. Everyone wants it. Everyone's trying to figure out how do I best integrate this, not only into my personal life, my daily life, but into my enterprise. And how is this going to transform my business? So at NVIDIA, we've been working on AI for a long time, and we're really looking to see how can we take generative AI and bring it into the enterprise sphere, where it has all the support, all the ecosystem engagement, and all the accelerated infrastructure required to run it. Cool, so that support, that engagement, when we look specifically at IT infrastructure, how is that being activated? Absolutely. I mean, this is one of the really interesting things today is people are trying their best to figure out how does AI fit into the existing data center, into the cloud, and into the personal devices that they run. So it's really being run across everything. And I think for a lot of enterprises, they're trying to understand what do I need to change and what can I use that I've been using for many years to, to orchestrate. And that's one of the reasons that NVIDIA is partnering so closely with Red Hat. I think you know Red Hat is the operating system of the data center. It runs everywhere. IT is very familiar with that. So we're trying to make sure that not only our accelerated infrastructure, but also all of our accelerated software libraries are running on the Red Hat platform, whether it's RHEL, whether it's OpenShift, and ensuring that it's supported from end to end with our NVIDIA AI Enterprise platform. And what rings in my mind right now is this notion of integration. Yes. How has the Red Hat and NVIDIA partnership really pursued that and really made it available within what you're offering? Absolutely, I mean, there are so many projects that are undergoing between NVIDIA and Red Hat every day, whether we're talking about our GPUs being integrated into OpenShift with our GPU operator, uh, DPUs, which are coming into the field, a brand new processing accelerator in the data center, uh, bringing that into the OpenShift world, uh, the work that we've done together with DGX at the far edge, so much more. Um, Really, it's an ongoing, you know, engineering to engineering uh, partnership that we're working on. Again, to try to make sure that all of this new technology, all these new workloads, all the sci-fi-ness comes into that enterprise managed world. Okay, so let's talk about, last question for you, an example scenario in the wild. Absolutely. So let's talk about you know generative AI. One of the big things today is about how do I as an enterprise customize and bring my own data into those enterprise generative AI workflows. So NVIDIA's built foundation models which we can use to give the enterprises a kickstart. Now once you've then done all that training and you've orchestrated that aspect, you need to be able to deploy this anywhere, whether that's into your data center, into another cloud, uh, or out at the far edge running on that accelerated platform. Platform. And that's where the orchestration tools and management that Red Hat offers really comes into play. So let's say I want to do a branded chatbot. I want it to speak my language. I want it to use the words that I want to use as an enterprise. And I want to make sure it doesn't stray too far from the bounds. Between NVIDIA and Red Hat, not only can you build that chatbot, but you can make sure that you're deploying it and running it in an intelligent fashion out there for all your customers. Wow, and you managed to fit the buzzword chatbot in. So I got it. Really <laughs> impressive. Thank you so much for your time today. Absolutely. Thank you so much.